breakfast we are dying sweating but it's nice it's amazing to be here finally yeah uh, exciting exciting from Chiquiaho 31 hours with a stopover in Madrid where we spend the night at the airport it was a long way long day the flight was very really exhausting and unfortunately we didn't sit each other only there was a middle way so we could not watch the movies in from the laptop so it was a bit hard and also I did not feel well for in the long flight so it was really hard but we made it yes we made it after arriving to Cancun airport, we made our way through the line of taxi drivers who are trying to offer you the best cheap trip, which is of course a lie. They are not cheap at all. So we made our way to the bus station of the ADO company, which is local company. The ticket costs only 98 pesos from airport to the Cancun downtown. It is like $5, so it's a very nice price. After that, we arrived to our Airbnb accommodation and we slept almost 12 yeah, hours, 12 hours. Yeah. Nice. just like it's really hard but uh, the other day in the morning we went to, to the local market market 23 great brunch yes amazing we had quesadilla empanadas and salbutas which is like a puffed softer tacos which is uh, originally from here yucatan peninsula so it was really great after this amazing brunch, we got our Mexican SIM cards from Telcel, which is the best coverage. It costed 350 pesos, again, pretty good price. Uh, and it has free social media, Facebook, Twitter and WhatsApp. and WhatsApp, which is pretty good. At least we can do video calls with our families, which is also good for them because they want to be in touch with us the whole time. Uh, we also did some translate work and after that we decided to walk around the main street and of course go to eat something. So we visit restaurants El Poblano where we had uh, quesadilla and fajitas. Another, another yummy meal, another yummy meal, really good, really good. And tomorrow we are looking forward to get to the beach finally in Zona Hotelera and maybe some Mayan ruins too, we'll see. New day, we are heading to Zona Hotelera now. We're gonna take the Adobus, which is a local bus transportation. It should be cheap. We are now heading there, so hopefully it's gonna be okay. We had a bit of problems with uh, taking out money from the ATM because <laughs> it was a bit problematic, but the problem in the end was that uh, I didn't have allowed the uh, uh, ATM transaction. So now it's okay, hopefully, and we're going. Finally go to the beach! Woo! So we are at the Playa Dolphin. There are not so many people, but there are a lot of people down there. Nicely clean, although there is a, quite a lot of seagrass. <laughs> sea <grass. laughs> but it's, that, doesn't, that doesn't matter. It's still very nice. Water it's really is warm. warm. Yeah, water is warm. Yeah, the seagrass is everywhere. It doesn't matter. It's still nice. Now in Parque de las Palapas, we are waiting for our lunch because we were hungry because on the Playa Delfinas there was there was nothing. We're gonna have cochinita pibil and tacos de pastor, right? Yes. It's gonna be right tasty, here. and we are gonna be using gonna and we are gonna be using our own plates to reduce the plastic. We are happy that it's the possibility in Europe. It can be problematic sometimes, so it's, it's good here. Another day, another trip. 
trip today to Isla Mujeres. We are in bus 6. <sighs> it's hot again. Normal. And we decided that we won't rent these cars because they are 1,000 yeah. pesos and expensive. it's a bit expensive and we decided to walk around and it's only like 8, eight kilometers. kilometers so it's two hours from the north to the south and back another two hours so it's enough for one day so yeah that's the low cost traveling yeah, low cost It's gonna be nice, right? Not so much. <laughs> 